Now at 4.30, the impact the unseasonable weather could have on hunting. And hunters looking to take home that prize trophy when it comes to gun deer hunting season, which starts next week. It may not feel like it outside, but the start of the gun deer season is right around the corner. Yeah, and meteorologist Brian Nisnansky finds out what effect this warm weather is having on our state deer population. After a couple warm winters and a very warm summer and now fall, you have to wonder if this abnormal weather changes a deer's behavior or even promotes population growth. According to the hunters we spoke with, recent hunting seasons have been average at best after a very harsh winter back in 2013-14. Shot a buck oh, three or four years ago, but uh, nothing since. But the more recent warmer winters just may bring a boost to the deer population. We're seeing more observations of fawns and does um, through our summer deer observations. So um, what's presumably a, a higher deer population in the area it should provide a better hunt for us. Wisconsin deer are entering mating season known as their rut. There's been speculation whether the deer will enter rut later this year due to the warm fall. But DNR says shortening length of daylight triggers rut, not temperature. Rut is upon us right now and we expect it to you know, continue through the nine day gun deer season. Now it may be more comfortable to hunt in the mild weather, but an arrival of cold and snow right on time would be a welcome sight for some. Maybe two or three inches of snow, so that way you can uh, track a deer if you do get it, or you can find your way out of the woods. Now the DNR is reminding hunters that you no longer have to wear a back tag, but you have to tag your deer carcass if you plan to leave it for any period of time. In Waukesha, Brian Isnanski, today's TMJ4. All right, Brian, thanks. If a colder hunt is more your thing, the holiday deer hunt is back this year starting around Christmas Eve for six counties in Wisconsin, including Waukesha and Milwaukee counties.